Okay, God knows how many clips I'm going to wind up with and how many will actually air, but this is post barefoot walking. And for having walked about a mile, maybe a mile and a half, in, um, with no shoes, no socks, that's really all the dirtier my feet got, and a lot of it was quite muddy back there, so I'm su surprised in how low impact that was. This is the, the bike that I'm usually on when I'm, when I'm walking and talking, for my Kansas videos anyway. And finally a few people are milling about. Again, they like these clearings, so I guess maybe that's part of the strategy to try to get people to use the park more for this deforestation plan. But you know what? I think the people need to adjust more than than nature needs to adjust for us, you know? Uh, I could see maybe putting a street lamp here and there, or maybe an emergency phone for protection, rather than clearing and felling these woods. And um, as I was mentioning in my clip, and then with Barefoot Sungazer. I, it, before I did any barefoot walking, which is just a few days ago, I'm very ground centric. I sleep on the floor sometimes. I, I do seem to derive some kind of energy from that. Oh, here comes a big ass bumblebee, or two of them. So you might see this clip drop fast. But, um, I, when I sit down on the ground, I get a sense of calm from, from the elements, I guess you could say, and some sort of, some sort of electrical exchange is occurring right now. If, if it wasn't kind of overgrown, I might lay down on the grass for a minute, but it's just the starting of spring here, and I mean, you can see ant colonies just forming for the first time. I'm sitting on a few, actually, and I might regret that later, but there's literally no place to sit that doesn't have them. Um, there is an energy source being exchanged right now. And for all I know, the ground might be benefiting from me being here and implanting something back through good intentions and breathing the carbon dioxide on the grass, obviously. And there is an old clip that I did back in January of 2012 where a spot that I laid down almost had a crop circle formation not long after and I had some kind of surreal experience there that essentially this is very good very beneficial and can't be underestimated actually and some something that I've noticed a lot of people saying when they are able to do this is uh, much of our daily stress seems like a triviality when you're here, literally at the ground level. And we'll just see where all this stuff is going, because I, I do have another connection to Barefoot Sun Gazer right now, and the, the Reiki attunement being a recent experience for me. I have performed it on myself a little bit, although it's not clear to me whether clockwise or counterclockwise implementation is important or not. If anything, it's a placebo effect too that has real, real benefits to it that I have felt. It's cleared a lot of blockages, um, especially in my stomach intestinal area. Anyway, I need to get back to the, the digital commercial world 
to scope out what is available right now. I <sighs> This is another topic I should broach briefly, but when you are unemployed, I find that it takes a long time to find employment. I've been at the same position now for about six months, and I find that the more you're in an employed setting, the more opportunities come your way. And I've had three people from other departments try to recruit me into theirs, and I'm not sure if they are positions I want, but synergy is really important and just getting in any kind of a network increases your opportunities manifold which is really important given that even even with a recovery going on there is only one position open for every 2.9 to 3.1 applicants in north america i i can't say how it is in europe though well and to broach yet another topic, the way the United States measures unemployment is not the same as how unemployment is measured in Europe either. After, I think it's, after your benefits are exhausted, and if a person has given up seeking work, they're not counted as unemployed anymore. So, we disguise our numbers quite masterfully over here. Whereas in Europe, I think the disclosure is much more closer to the fact. So, while a huge recovery is happening here and a bubble is being built up, I think that, um, I think that, well, I think someone's trying to listen in on what we're filming here. But I think that uh, there's a lot more difficulty in employment seeking than is reported. And you have to get into some kind of a social system. Because once again, our economy is becoming more social and interactive. You cannot be in isolation in any way. The only way you can ever get money or thrive is by interactivity with others so that's something else to keep in mind I appreciate your viewership as usual and I apologize if it's very discombobulated and confusing with this series of clips with all the stops and starts today thank you and have a great day bye